Guys, Trace Adams, today is Monday, returning Tuesday by 2 o'clock Eastern with your next comp release. We've got a freebie coming in football between the Rams and the Seahawks in just one moment. Speaking of football, yesterday, a 2-0 sweep of the board to make it four of six winning days. It was a top-rated 1,000 star, Dallas and Detroit. NFC total of the year going over the posted total, and you got it for just $5.00 as those teams with that wild combined fourth quarter to take us over the total rather handily come that final buzzer. Also, a 500-star pay after you win, absolute blowout. San Francisco over Jacksonville. I predicted a 35-10 to final. It was actually 42-10. to I'll take it. It's a winner. It's a 2-0 sweep. It's four of six days on the plus side. And tonight, top-rated 1,000-star winner number five of six goes out on your football game between Seattle and St. Louis. That is a top-rated 1,000-star winner number five of six. Also, a 500-star pay-after-you-win total release for game five of the World Series between the Red Sox and the Cardinals. As you well know, at $1 bet per unit this year in baseball, 11,200 units won. At just $1 bet, you're up over eleven grand in Major League Baseball for the entire season. Tonight, we add another 500-unit play to it. It must win or you will not be charged. That's the way the pay-after-win play works. There you have it. There it is for Monday. Comp winner tonight, let's play under in the football game between the Rams and the Seahawks. I have a feeling there are not going to be too, too many points on this nationally televised contest, and that is due to the fact that you've got a backup quarterback in Kellen Clemens on the field for St. Louis. And let's look at it this way. Seattle defense has been very staunch, and the series history has also shown us that the under has been the way to go. Five of the last six meetings since 2010 have gone under the posted total. We'll take under again. Seahawks and Rams under. We'll talk to you Tuesday, 2 Eastern. As always, Trace Adams, dead serious about winning.